and so the trees die. Yeah, that's what humans need. Hello dear backpackers, I feel I owe you some explanation as to what trip you're actually watching. Allow me, therefore, to give you some geographic context. This is Europe, the old continent. This is Poland, right in the center of it. There are many mountain ranges here, among them my favorite, Beskide. Generally, you can divide them into the western and the eastern part, but truly a much more granular division is used. You have Beskid Śląski, Beskid Mały, Beskid Żywiecki, Beskid Makowski, Beskid Wyspowy, Gorce, Beskid Sądecki, and also the most eastern one, Beskid Niski. We started our journey in Beskid Żywiecki. From Przysłów Potucki we went on to Przełęcz Przegibek and Hala Rycerzowa, Młoda Chora, Przełęcz Kotarz and Muńcu, on to Danielka or what is also known as Chałupa Chemików. This is the place you have also seen in the part 1 of this video. The next morning we went to Ujsowe and Kręci Chłosty through Hala Lipowska, Rysianka, Hala Miziowa, on to Hala Gurowa. This is where we slept and where you have seen the hot showers technology I showed you in part 1. Next day, from Hala Gurowa, we went on to Hala Miziowa, we had to double back, and then we went all the way along the border into Głuchaczki. This is also where part 1 ends, and part 2 will begin. Although I'm sure Polish names, such as Przełęcz Kotarz, Kręci Chłosta or Przełęcz Przegibek, may be not only difficult to remember, but even just to pronounce... Grzegorz Brzęczy-Szczykiewicz. Brzęczy-Szczykiewicz. Don't worry, I named them just so you have reference of where we are. For now, just sit back and enjoy part two. And there it is. You probably can only see highlights of it. But that is the first, third, sorry, base camp, Guhachki. And boy, it's been a long day. <sighs> Today we are supposed to go on Babia Gura, but we decided that we needed a break. And the fact is that it's already late because we've been picking some berries again and got a full bottle of them. So that's quite nice. In the meantime, I'll let you enjoy the forest around.
So we are on our way again. We were able to use a bit of a cheat because Barcia's parents have a house nearby, so we stayed overnight. But anyway, there's a lot of place to stay in Savoia, so you can do it as well. And today we go up there, Babiagura, also known as Diablak, which is a, you could translate it into the Devil's Mountain. The highest peak of Beskide, over 1700 meters above the sea level. Then we're gonna go to Przewęcz Krogarki and then to our sleeping place in Zubrzyca. Let's go! Szczawinę. Apparently, there is enough. Sorry about that. Apparently, there is enough of everything in that soup. Shit. For four people. That's nothing in there. <laughs> it's just soup. Gladly, we got our own pasta. Because we're well prepared. <laughs> you can't see it this well this time, but there in the distance are the Tatra Mountains. And last time we were here, they were beautifully lit by the sunset. Fortunately, we don't have much luck this time. But you can see the counter and how massive they are. You can see them all over from the beginning. Stretching all the way there. Epic. Oh. Yeah. 
Not sure if you can see it, but the lady actually has a child on her back. It's a Brzyca Dolna, surrounded by woods, is a camping site. There are actually two, uh, two camping sites, one is right by the street, the, one, the other one you have to go into the wood and walk about 15 minutes and you get here. It's 15 slots per person, uh, you have hot showers. Funny toy toys, toilets, but they are nice and place to wash your clothes and off and then dry drying place. So it's really nice. A lot of space. A lot of people as well, but mainly kids so far. But they yeah. Not very quiet, but I think it'll be fine. And back there. You can see highlights of Tatra Mountains. If the visibility was better, and I hope it will be tomorrow, you could actually see them pretty well. And if you're going here by September or maybe early October, I bet you will be able to see snow on the peaks of the mountains. And it's the reception. Very nice.